We've been hearing about it everywhere, and I want I wanted to watch it because it seemed like everybody was talking about it, and it was gonna be like the next big thing. So I want to be in there. You know, I love all that cheese, man. I love knowing what's coming up. So I took my four-year-old um, with me, and we watched it. And I have to tell you, it totally blew me away. I mean, it worked the crap out of that 3D animation. It is ridiculous just how much texture there is. Um, like, it's, like, well, you know when they show you, like, the 3D commercials, and, like, something's being thrown at you, and the people go, <gasps> that is exactly what this movie was like. I mean, there's, like, this one scene where they're doing the games, and somebody throws like this, uh, like this weight. Um, it's like it, 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 they're acting, it's acting like a shot put, but it's this weight, and so they throw it. And oh my goodness, like you literally went back because you felt like it was coming towards you. Um, and nowhere can you feel the, can you see the texture more than in Meredith's hair, which is the main character, the teenager. I mean, you look at her hair and you see like all the curls and the tangles and it makes you want to take out a comb and comb it because it's such a hot mess. Um, but seriously, it's that good. I mean, it's incredibly realistic. Uh, and I'm just talking about like the scenery and stuff. I mean, it's just really good. It's just, the scenes are incredible. I mean, you have to watch this one in 3D. You know how like every movie out there is in 3D right now? Well, this is one that you have to watch it in 3D. It's that good. Um, yeah, I mean, there's no regret. I mean, you thought Avatar was, like, amazing? No, Brave is amazing. And I know I'm I'm putting it out there and I'm probably going to get a lot of backlash, but it's true. Merida is a teenager and she has, obviously, two parents, the queen and the king. And she's a princess and they want her to marry one of the three princesses and... Uh, princess. Um, princess? Princess? I don't know. So anyways, they want to marry one of those three guys. And she's like, no way. You know, I want to be on my own. I want to do my own thing. And the queen is like, no, you have to. It's tradition. You're going to ruin everything. Blah, blah, blah. So they have all these games to see who's going to win her heart. Because, you know, every woman wants to be won. Like a prize. Um, so they have this... You know, all these games, and this one guy, you know, wins her because he shoots at the target, and so she comes out with, like, her bow and arrow, and she shoots him, and she says, hey, no one's gonna win me but me. Uh, so, anyway, things don't turn out the way they're supposed to. So then she goes to a witch, the witch turns the mom into a bear. <laughs> I know, it's kind of ridiculous, but it works. Um... So, okay, so the, it turns into a bear, then the bear, then Meredith finds out that she's a bear, so then she's trying to turn it back into a mom, and along the way, she learns a lot of stuff. Okay, so the plot's over, if you're coming back with us, I'm going to tell you what I liked about the movie. Um, I liked the three little boys, the, the, the uh, Meredith's brothers. They were really cute. Um, it's a funny movie. It is. Uh, I, my four-year-old enjoyed it. I mean, you know, he didn't understand a lot of it. And, like, there's this one little part where, like, the king slaps the queen's butt. And I think only the parents got that. Um, but anyways, I liked it. I, I enjoyed the movie. I thought uh, the plot isn't groundbreaking or anything. It's different. But, I mean, it's not going to win by the story. It's going to win. I mean, whatever prizes it wins or awards, it's going to win because, like, it was the way it was made. It's pretty amazing. Um, the characters were funny. Um, the bear scenes, if you have kids that are scared easily, like, um, or four and under, be careful with, um, with the bear scenes when they're fighting. And there's more than one. Um, simply because, uh, because the 3D is so good, <laughs> it's kind of funny, because the 3D is so good, I mean, it's like in your face, and it's kind of scary, I mean, I was like, whoa, you know, so my four-year-old was like, uh-oh, like, it was just, uh, I don't know, like, it was just very realistic, because, you know, they're really doing something different, um, so be careful if you have younger kids, just know when there's a bear, it's gonna be kind of creepy, um, the wisp, which is like these little lights, but they really look more like ghosts. And my kid is into like zombies and all that creepy stuff. Uh, 
so he was like, wow, you know, there's little ghosts that are making, that the merit is following. Um, but, you know, that might be kind of creepy, too, for younger kids. The witch, she's kind of ugly. That's kind of creepy. So, I mean, there's some dark moments. But for the most part, uh, it's pretty light. It's a good movie. Um, I, I liked it. I mean, like, this is, this is trumping Tangled, which Tangled was, like, a big deal. Um, but the reason that Tangled, I mean, Tangled had, like, really good music. Um, and this one has good music, too, but it's nothing like, like, you know, Tangled was. I mean, that was amazing. Um, but this one, I mean, just the movie itself, I mean, you can watch it with, with no sound, and you're going to be pretty impressed. So I totally recommend you watch it. Um, and when it comes out on Blu-ray, and if you have a 3D TV, you should get it on 3D. Um, I don't. So, but anyways, I have an HD TV, so that counts, right? That's pretty good. Um, so watch it. Let me know what you think, because I enjoyed it. My four-year-old enjoyed it, and I think your family will enjoy it too. And I'm pretty excited to see what kind of numbers it's going to bring in.